my channel. Today is Sunday. I was going to say it's Saturday because yesterday I spent so much time doing work and also going outside. I was outside loads yesterday because it was a super, super sunny day, which was amazing. It was so warm. Thing is, it was only like 11 degrees, but I'm going to be honest with you, it felt like 20 degrees. No exaggeration at all. I was outside in shorts, a short sleeve t-shirt. I had leggings underneath my shorts, but still, it was so warm. I went on my trampoline. I had a great day yesterday, though I did spend like four hours writing my essay last night because it was during at midnight last night and I ended up writing it like like, I don't know, in the evening, I handed it in at like 10 o'clock. So that was um, not great leaving it that last minute, but there we go. Today's vlog is a little bit random. I just really, really felt like vlogging. So I thought I would vlog today because I'm actually doing something. I'm actually leaving the house, which is a very exciting event. As many of you know, if you live in the UK or to be honest, if you kind of live anywhere, really, uh, it's a very exciting thing if you can actually leave the house when, you know, we're in lockdown. So today I am going to town to get a passport photo taken because I need to renew my passport because it's my birthday like next week or something. I also turn 17 next week and I'm going to sign up for my provisional driving license which basically means that I can drive on the road with someone who can drive if that makes sense. So like my parents can be in the passenger seat and I can drive um, but obviously they are there to help me if that makes sense so i can actually learn on the roads rather than driving around our field which is really exciting but i need to get a photo taken for it and i also need to get a new passport because it, my passport ran out like last year so i'm gonna go downstairs actually i need to get my stuff ready to go and we're gonna head to town and i'm so excited and i think we might also go in super drug because i'm doing a giveaway on my instagram soon when i reach 500 followers and so i want to get a few bits and bobs for that and i also kind of want to do some care packages for a few of my friends but I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to be able to do that yet it depends how much I it ends up costing so I'll see how it all goes but I already have one thing for the giveaway already and then I'm just going to buy a few more things I also need to get a new mascara because the one I'm wearing right now is the one that I need to get a new one of uh I know this is really bad but I've had this mascara for four or five years which I know is massively out of date but it's fine like it's been fine on my eyes the only thing is it's basically running out. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling on. I'm going to try and make this vlog as interesting as it can be because I ha it's been so long since I've done a vlog where I've actually been going somewhere or doing something more exciting than just tidying my room or what, something like that. So I'm honestly <laughs> excited to be filming a more normal vlog. Um, so let's grab my stuff. I need to grab some money because obviously I've got to get my passport photo and also I might go into super drug and also get my mask i've honestly lost two of my masks i don't know about you guys but since i finished school i had three masks and i've lost two of them i have no idea where they are so that's really really frustrating because i loved the masks that i had one of them my friend made for me and the other one my uncle gave me and it was like really really nice and i'm a bit annoyed about that so i'm gonna probably order one from a small business so comment down below any small businesses that do sell face masks that i could buy from and let me know about that because i'd be very very interested in getting one we are in town <laughs> so sunny basically it was really really foggy when we left the house like super foggy we could barely see anything now the sun's come out it's blue skies barely any clouds it's actually quite warm now isn't it yeah when we left the house it was freezing no it's quite hot um so we're gonna head into the booth get photos taken my sister needs one as well but it's kind of going to be kind of difficult because obviously she's a baby and you need to get like her face in but you can't get our hands in so i'm not sure how we're going to do that we'll just try and figure that out and then i'll speak to you in a little bit when we've done that we've just done mine and we're back in the car no don't eat the camera don't eat the camera she's gonna have hers done in a minute there was someone else queuing up so we've let them go come back and check on farley and then we're gonna go and get my sister's done in a minute which is gonna be really difficult to try and hold her without getting ourselves in <laughs> This is really difficult to do, look at <laughs> These are the attempts so far. As you can see, I am now home. I never really film in this corner of my room because this is where my bed is, but because the window's here, it's a bit sort of side lit. So I don't usually film here. However, I think it looks kind of cute. So I just wanted to show you what I got from Super Drug because I did end up going in the end. And oh, another side note, as you would have seen, my, the mask I had on, 
I did find it. That spotty one was from my uncle and it was in my coat pocket that I wore for school before Christmas and I thought I'd lost it, but turns out I hadn't. So anyways, let's get back to showing you what I got from Superdrug. So basically, um, some of these things I got for myself and then some of the things are going to be in the giveaway. So I'll show you the things I got for myself first because there's only a couple of those. Whereas there's quite a lot of items I got for the giveaway. It did end up being a little bit pricey in the end. But yeah, I'm still really happy with everything that I've got for the giveaway and I really, really hope you guys like it. So I don't know exactly when the giveaway is going to be going up because it's all dependent on when I do hit 500 followers on Instagram. So if you're not already following my Instagram, it'll be on the screen now. Please go and follow it because... There'll be a giveaway when I reach 500. I'm now, I think I'm like five away from 400. So I think it will probably be in like a month's time maybe or just under when I'm at 500. So thank you so much for following me, by the way. If you already are following me, that really means a lot. So thank you so much. So I got three things for myself. The first thing are these Garnier micellar reusable eco pads so i always use the micellar water to remove my makeup and i usually get cotton pads from primark or wherever wherever they're pretty cheap and they they do the job however i've been seeing things about these and i try to be as eco-friendly as i can i am trying to really really improve on um, buying things that are more eco-friendly etc so when I came across these I thought this is just such a brilliant idea I've seen it floating around um, online but I've never actually purchased them but I saw these I think they were like £4.49 or something like that from Superdrug and you get three pads inside I think they are actually about that sort of size and you basically put them in the washing machine to wash them and they can have 1000 washes per pad so essentially you're pretty much buying 3000 cotton pads um well the equivalent of 3000 cotton pads in here and just, this is so so much better for the environment it's just a lot lot better so i'm very excited to try these out i'll let you know how i got on with them i'm sure they'll be great and i'm just happy that i can actually sort of contribute to helping the environment and not be using so many cotton pads and wasting them all you know so i'm excited to try these out so i've got those i then got this new mascara because as i said earlier i think i told you guys earlier i wanted a new mascara because the one i've been using at the minute is like four years old and it's running out it's got it's probably out of date to be honest and yeah i just thought it's probably time for me to get a new one so the one i had before was maybelline Bolsey's push-up drama one I think it's in a red shiny packet but they didn't have it in the store and I've looked online and I'm pretty sure it's you can still buy it from different places but they didn't have it in Superdrug so instead I got this and I'm pretty sure this is very new I think um it's the Maybelline Lash Sensational Sky High Mascara and I'm very very excited this is obviously in black oh my gosh it says this only has six months like once you opened it, it goes out of date in six months if the other one was the same and I've been using it for four years oh my gosh that is so bad I need to stop doing that but i hate checking things away when they're not run out so anyways that's kind of irrelevant the packaging on this is absolutely gorgeous i literally love it so it's basically like a pinky rose gold color it's honestly so gorgeous so <laughs> love this and this was 9.99 i'm pretty sure this is what the wand looks like i like the plastic ones better than the sort of brush ones because i find that it kind of just separates my lashes better and makes them longer and stuff so i'm very very excited to use this one the final thing i got for myself is kind of a part of it's for the giveaway part of it is for me so um i got three face masks because it was three for two in super dry and oh my goodness i keep trying to turn them around and turning them upside down again anyways so there's a coconut manuka honey and pink clay and um, i'm not sure which ones i'm gonna keep and which one i'm gonna put in the giveaway i think i might put the pink clay one in the giveaway because i feel like that's my favorite but i feel like you guys really like that one um but yeah two of these i'm gonna keep for myself and one of them i'm gonna put in the giveaway this is what they look like they're really really cute and these would have been like 99p each but i got it three for two so it was like two pounds for three face masks which is really good and then this i already had uh but this is going to be part of the giveaway and it's a dirty works hello weekend pamper bag and it comes with body wash and body butter and it comes in this such a cute bag it's like it's got a rose gold zip a pink tassel it's like sort of jungle themed it's honestly so cute and it just looks really nice also 
I can kind of smell it through the bag and it smells so good. So this will be in the giveaway, guys. I hope you like that. And then we've got a Carmex for the giveaway. So this is the strawberry Carmex. And I know that Carmex is kind of like a big thing, you know, it's kind of like a trend sort of thing. Like, what do you call it a trend? I don't know, it's just a popular item for like teenagers. And this is what it looks like. I think this was like three pounds something like three pound fifty or something the next thing i got was this so body mist oh my gosh i just said so and then it says so on here and it's a body mist and this is the scent ibiza dreams now as you will have known if you've been watching my videos for a while i did actually go to ibiza in 2019 and it was so amazing and i just thought i've got to get the ibiza one because i've obviously been there i remember smelling this in super drunk like years ago and really liking the smell of it so that's why i picked this one as well um but i can't actually remember what it smelled like so oh that smells incredible it smells a little bit like the Ariana Grande perfume. You definitely want to get your hands on this. This is so nice. I can't remember how much this was, but it's like the little travel size one. And it's just so great to put in your handbag. Like it's a perfect size. Or your school bag or whatever. It's just perfect to put in your bag. This next item is kind of exciting because it's quite pricey. and it's But it's just such a good product. So this is the Real Techniques Beauty Blender. Now, I've got a Real Techniques Beauty Blender. And I think they're the best beauty blenders out there. And in fact it is the number one makeup sponge it says on the packet um so obviously real techniques is a very very good brand it's very expensive i would say um but i think it's very good quality so it makes up for the price you know what i mean so this is just the orange sponge and it's really really cool and the final item that will be in the giveaway i'm not 100 percent sure if this would definitely be the final item or whether i'll add anything else into the giveaway i'm not 100 percent sure yet I got a simple refreshing facial wash and obviously simple is a very very good brand it's great for sensitive skin as it says on here I think this is a travel size but I'm not sure because it's actually quite big like for travel so it might not be a travel size I'm not sure because it's quite big isn't it I just thought this would be a really really good essential for anybody's skincare routine so I thought this would be great to put in the giveaway I'm just so excited to do this giveaway so please follow me on Instagram so that we can get the giveaway up and running on my on my Instagram and um, also please subscribe to my YouTube I'm not entirely sure what the like terms and conditions of how you can enter the giveaway is but obviously I will confirm those details nearer the time but in a couple weeks time look out for the details of how to enter and you might be able to get your hands on these items which is so exciting I honestly can't wait to give back to you guys because I just feel like I've had so much support and so many lovely comments and I've gained so many of you recently which is amazing like just to have more of you in my YouTube and Instagram family and TikTok actually as well. Um, I've now been doing TikToks so honestly my username on everything I'm pretty sure is Sparkle Rewind so if you just search up Sparkle Rewind on any of them it should come up and you can just follow me on my social medias right so i thought i'd pop this little clip into the video where i'm going to try out the new mascara so it is now the next day and i've just popped on a little bit of concealer under my eyes and stuff and so i'm going to try out the new mascara i'm actually so excited the brush is really nice this is what the first eye looks like so far whoa oh my gosh look at that I think it looks really good, oh my gosh. Okay, we're at a very, very strange angle right now, but I've just quickly propped you up. So I'm gonna try out these eco pads. So I've got the Garnier Micellar Water, which this is not sponsored, but very coordinated here with my Micellar Water and the eco pads. So I'm just gonna, I don't know how much I'm supposed to put on, but oops, I just spilled it. I'm gonna put this on here. I'm getting this everywhere. Wait, I didn't actually read the instructions. Am I supposed to put it on the pink side? Apparently you're supposed to put it in the washing machine about once a week. That's interesting. Oh my gosh. This sounds so weird, but it like feels really nice because it's so soft. Like I said, I have no idea which side I'm supposed to put the stuff on, but I'm assuming it doesn't really matter. It's really hard to explain, but it just feels like so nice because the thing is so soft. Oh my gosh. This gets a thumbs up from me so far. Oh my goodness. That was so soft on my skin like that just made my skin feel really 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 nice when i was taking it off rather than being like quite rough with the cotton pads so i definitely give that a thumbs up 
I hope I used them correctly because I was just trying to quickly do it and I didn't actually read the instructions properly. I think that I did it right, um, but I'll double check after uh, later, but I'm pretty sure. I, and I just rinsed it under the tap after I used it and then just put it on the towel rail to dry out. So um, that's, I think that's all you need to do. And um, thank you so, so much for watching. I really, really hope you enjoyed this vlog. It's been a little bit just sort of random it's just a general sunday in my life i guess but it's actually been more exciting than a lot of my sundays because i've actually been somewhere which is really exciting um i'm about to watch descendants 2 with megan now because we watched descendants 1 a couple weeks ago for like the fifth time wow however many times we've watched it because i'm obsessed with descendants as you know if you've watched the isle of sky vlogs you know that me and megan are obsessed and we're just gonna watch number two right now we're gonna join streamer on disney plus so that is what i'm doing this evening i'm gonna pop on my pajamas have a nice relax and then get ready for school again tomorrow so thanks so much for watching i will see you again soon oh also my video is uploading right now walk talk and tea episode i want to say four and so please go and watch that video if you haven't already and i'll see you again soon lots of love sparkle rewind bye